The first option uh, to rebuild in place was going to take a long time, twice as long, really, and a lot more money. Same with the remodel, twice as long and a lot more money. Um, the third option, I don't really like to think about, closing St. Elizabeth's Hospital. Um, and so it was decided the fourth option was the best, uh, to uh, build a regional medical center on the interstate uh, that could service um, our sister hospitals. So we have sister hospitals in Breeze, St. Joseph's in Breeze, and St. Joseph's in Highland. And it's very difficult for those community members to get to downtown Belleville. Some people said to me, well, why did it take you so long to decide? Well, it took us a long time to decide because the sisters um, spent a lot of time uh, looking at the options, uh, discerning. People say, well, what does that mean, discerning? That means praying. Our sisters prayed a lot about this decision that they made. It was not made lightly. There's been a lot of things said about the move. Um, that I want to dispel. Uh, I think the number one thing being that we're running away from our mission and our ministry. And I can tell you that that is the farthest thing from the truth. Um, our sisters have been here for 140 years. Our mission statement, our mission statement is to reveal and embody Christ's healing love for all people. What will not happen is we will not leave an abandoned building here. Um, people have said, and I've read in the newspaper, that they're just planning on leaving an abandoned building and people are going to throw rocks through the windows and it's become, going to become an eyesore for Belleville. And that's not true. Um, if no one wants this building, we will raise the building. We'll tear the building down. And then I would like to hear from the community. Uh, I've been trying to get engagement from the community on what might, want, what might the community want to be on this land. We're leaving St. Elizabeth's Belleville campus. And what that means is we're leaving um, a walk-in clinic. Uh, we are leaving uh, radiology services, we're leaving laboratory services, uh, we are leaving uh, mammography services here, we're leaving other uh, services that are non-clinical related. Family practice doctors will stay here. Um, Southern Illinois Healthcare Foundation is, is keeping a practice here as well. Our patients uh, will have an outpatient center here, uh, and when they get sick and they need inpatient services, we fully expect all of them um, those that are poor and vulnerable, those that have, those that can pay, we expect all of them uh, to go to our uh, campus, uh, our new campus on, on Interstate 64.